this will be a really short video. So auto autonomic responses are things that we do ourselves, not to be confused with autonomy, which is the self-severing, like a lizard losing its tail, stuff like this. So dogs urinating is probably a good example of this. This can be territorial, like you see in the first image here. And a lot of these behaviors are going to relate to dogs because we're just very familiar with their behaviors. Um, but it can also be a stress response as well. So a lot of times when a dog becomes nervous or gets frightened, their bladder loosens and they pee. And you probably have seen that sometimes, like if the dog gets overly excited. And so this, this, could, go, this could be a stress response too. And, and you relate it to nervousness and now to that. Thermoregulation of many animals, you think of birds especially that have hair or feathers and they get erected. Cats, the hair on their back getting high you know, when, they're get, when they get angry and aggressive. All these things happen. We tend to sweat in times of stress. Now a lot of animals don't really have sweat glands anymore like we do. But so a lot of times this is a scent that's given off, which does with that too. But we as humans often sweat, you know, we talk about sweating when we're nervous with things like that too. And so sweat glands evolved into scent glands and this is all a lot of territory marking and stuff. Dogs often greet you by licking your face. And they originally this was probably either a pup asking for, for food or it was a dog doing like an olfactory report saying like, hey, where what did you eat? Did you find something good? Could I go eat that too? And so they're kind of investigating to see what's going on here. And nowadays it's just kind of a ritualized greeting. It's something that we do when we come up. It's, you know, pack animals. Hey, did you find food? You found food, where is it? As, and now it's it's ritualized into this greeting that we see here. But anyway, I'm going to stop right here because we're going to shift gears and I'll be right back.